Pastor Croy here, another week of doing a song, and this week, instead of starting out with a song, I wanted to give you a Bible verse instead, uh, a Bible verse from Romans, chapter 6, verse 4, Romans 6, 4 says, Therefore we are buried with him by baptism into death, that like as Christ was raised up from the dead by the glory of the Father, even so we also should walk in newness of life. I'm going to focus on the end of that verse, in newness of life. Now, in life, it's great when there's new beginnings. I love springtime. We're actually in springtime right now when trees are budding, flowers are blooming. It's a great time in life. And not only in, is there a newness of life outside in the world, but there's newness of life in my life. For many weeks, I said I was going to show you baby Blake. And this week, I will show you my son, baby Blake. Come here, Blakey. He's right over here. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is baby Blake. He was born this past Wednesday, nine pounds, six ounces. Want to say something, baby Blake? Talk to the camera. We were just chatting a minute ago. Say something. Say What's going on? You're doing a lot of sleeping, a lot of studying. It's so weird, he talks all the time, but just not now. Now he doesn't say much these days, but here, you want your pacifier back? He put his pacifier back in his mouth. You want your pacifier? Come on, come on. There you go. Anyway, newness of life. Now, was like I said, I was thinking about that verse and I said, hey, there's newness of life in my life right here with Blake. He's just praising Jesus like he does. And newness of life, not only in my life, but in the church as well. If you didn't hear, this Sunday, June 7th, we're actually having church uh, for the first time since we've, uh, since we've left in March. We're having church again at our church uh, on June the 7th, Sunday morning. So if you can make it out, please come out, join the service, and just grow in your relationship with Jesus Christ. I hope that you're saved. If you are saved, that's great. But we should be growing, like I said, in newness of life in Christ. And I was reading about that, and I was like, wow. How much in my life right now is there newness growing up in my life? Not only with my son. Like I said, it is springtime. And with church getting back in, and with the economy coming back to life, I'm like, wow, there's a lot of newness of life springing around right now in my life. It was just a great thought. So... Like I said, June 7th, if you can make it out, we're going to have a great service. We're going to have a lot of singing. We're going to have great preaching. I miss all of you coming out to church. And uh, like I said, I hope you can be there. And who knows? Maybe baby Blake will be there. He won't be there probably this Sunday. But I'm sure in the future you guys will get to meet him. And uh, like I said, this is a new time in my life and my wife's life as this is our first child. And thank you for praying for her and for me during this time. It's been a very big learning process sleepless nights uh, but through it all um, it's a big blessing having our son here so thanks for uh, joining in and we'll see you next week